Okay. Um, first of all, Danny stated that the schools had no right to search and seize you, which searching your body falls under drug testing. Uh, second of all, I never said that 801 schools in Pennsylvania implemented drug testing. I said that there just was 801 schools in Pennsylvania. And how are you going to say that alcohol is better than drugs? Because with all the recent DUIs and hit, hitting runs, alcohol is not looking better than any other drug. And then you also said in your constructions that drug, uh, students that use drugs don't do well on standardized tests, but then you went on later to say that Obama used drugs. And I'm pretty sure he went to Yale and the Chicago School of Law, so I think he was pretty smart. Um, you also said that you would only test for um, cannabis, cocaine, and heroin. Those are the only drugs that are out there, so if you're only going to test for those three drugs, then students will just defer to other drugs. Um, and you also said that your drugs weren't meant to ruin people's lives. They were just meant to put in a fear factor. But you, and you also said that students that use drugs had less respect for like administrators and parents. So what are they going to be scared of if they don't respect their, the uh, administrators? Um, and you also said that it wasn't supposed to be like, it was supposed to be a, just a deterrent from using drugs. And why would you waste all this money on something that's not even going to, in your plan, isn't even going to end drug, drug use? Also, you stated in your, um, you had a little story about a high school. And what was, you never mentioned what their drug, the drug use in that high school was prior to the test. For all we know, there could have been no drug use in that school to begin with, so students didn't really care. Uh, you also said you didn't want to ruin people's lives again. What if you have to expel a student because he tests wrong on a test? What if the test comes back positive, but the student really never really took drugs, and you expel him? Is that going to ruin? I feel like that might ruin his life. And you can still, and as I stated before with Barack Obama, you can still get into college if you take drugs. You also said that you need seventh graders. You're going to test seventh, and, and I'm assuming eighth graders as well as high school students. Me and Danny's fat about the $33.8 million being spent is only for high schools. So if you're going to add two more grades to that, that even just raises the price. Thank you.